hey guys it's z here back with another tutorial i hope you all are doing great so a lot of you guys have asked me to make a tutorial on my latest cc because it has some rambo type things that you call it but i call them light flares or light leaks so you have been asking me like how i did that so they are just some overlays that i found on internet that's what i use so for this CC, you're going to need some light leaks and some other stuff. I'll uh, upload them on my Discord server. So join it from the link in the description and get your overlays and other manga material from there. For now, let's get straight into the tutorial. So after you have completed your edit, import it back in your project. Now what you need to do is add these light leaks. Now what you need to do first is adjust their size, like make them as big as the screen. Then go to their blend, then change their mode to screen. Now you have to see like according to your clips if they are looking good or no like I'll upload a bunch of these light flares on my Discord server but for me only one uh, worked so I use only one. After adjusting them what you need to do is select your clips not the overlays then go to adjustment make exposure minus 5 contrast 10 and make shadow between minus 26 to minus 30 and white should be 15. Now you don't have to change anything else. From below there if you want to add sharpen it depends upon you. you you can add it now for the temperature you can also reduce it but for my CC I do both like sometimes I reduce the temperature but this time I'll just increase it to 18 so now your CC should look something like this and now we'll add an effect called chromatic quirk add it like below these overlays we are going to add some keyframes like add a keyframe at the starting then go two frames forward make its uh, upper value to 60 then go again two frames forward make it 50 again then again go two frames forward make it 55 then again go two frames forward and make it back to 50. now just split it right there and then just copy paste it that it should cover all of your clips now we are going to add another effect below this effect search an effect called luminance We'll use it for a glow now for this adjustment make its filter zero then rotation between 25 to 30 for the strength as you saw in the preview that it was flickering so we are gonna add some keyframes as we did in chromatic quirk so just do the same and then just copy paste it but make sure that the strength should not go above 40 because it will look too much glowy and it will not look good now your CC is almost done you just need one more thing to do so for that what you need is add this PNG then put it below these effects then make it a bit big then change its blend mode to overlay and now you're finally done with your CC now if you want it to be a bit more darker then you can adjust your shadow to 30 or 35 and then you'll be done see you guys next time till then bye bye